what's going on? Yeah. What's going on, guys? King here from KSP, and today we're playing American Truck Simulator, of course, because it is Simulator Sunday. So about last Simulator Sunday, I didn't make a video. Um, I've been working on other things, which you will see on the channel in the future. Um, I didn't buy special transport yet, if y'all want me to buy it. Let me know in the comments section below, but for now, I'm not going to get it. Let's see. Oh, that actually feels a lot better to press the gas pedal and stuff with you. After this video, I'll probably be about ready to leave. I'm going to get a job market. I don't think I have a job yet. And I never got to explore Oregon yet. I'm working on it. It gives me more for the same distance. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, I have a delivery? How do I deliver? Oh, I see. Oh, wait, man, I crashed it and I, like, at the last second and then just gave up. I was on my phone while doing it, and I think I hit someone and just gave up on my Let's see. Hey, it didn't save that. Oh, wait. Parking brake off. First gear. Got it. Go. Let me see here. So I saw some about Volvo being an American truck similar right now. I don't know if it's in the new place up there. We will see. Right now I only have Kenworth dealers unlocked. I need to get at least one Peterbilt and one Volvo in the near future. And sorry to start this off with a unfinished route. I should have gotten in the game and checked that first. That trailer is new, and that truck that's pulling it, I don't think I've seen before. But that trailer is definitely new. Oh no, that was from the beginning of this game, and I've never seen it since. That's cool. I've seen that trailer, like, at the very beginning, before any DLC, and that's the Ford truck. I've seen that before. That trailer, um, I haven't seen since the beginning of this game. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's the trailer that used to be in the game. not and there was no trailer then smack me I give me something else but I'm pretty sure that trailer was but once we go on the road here uh, we will be talking about uh, what that project was I'm not going go back in go back in my um, trailer that we get with y'all, but since this one is just kind of finishing up, parking brake neutral. Let's see, and end them. Okay, results. Continue. Okay, let's get this going. Where is? Please tell me that one's still available. Yes. Okay, it's a back choice a little bit, but hey, that's fine. Turn it on. Of course. First gear, and then break off, go forward, not backward. No, I need to turn around in here. That trailer, I think, is going in the wrong direction. Actually, let me see where that trailer is going, and then. Because if that trailer is going where I need it to go, I might just pick up that one. Nope, it is not. Okay. So I will have to I think my mods working though for realistic traffic. I'll clear it that way. But not clear that way, and then once that way gets cleared, I'm gonna have traffic this way. Hey it is realistic traffic. Good job. Alright, hopefully no. No, no, no. Alright, it's clear that way. Nope, I can't do that. But this thing is the car. 
Do not mistake it for one. It cannot be toy. I come on, give me a bike. I think after that truck and trailer. No, there it is more. Why is it only Ford so that's scary in that trailer? And then of course. In real life and in games. Come on. That hard to give me a clear. I think there's a red light over there. We've been doing for the past hour. Come on. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not going to Still get that way, but now I get this way. Holy crap. <coughs> That's realistic though. I got that. I need to get gas too. Shit. Alright, is it just in this town? I'm picking up or do I have to go a little bit? Okay, it is in this town. A truck dealer in Flagstaff. That's a Peterbilt. That I can't look real quick. I think I see a truck dealer. I see here. What's the truck dealer symbol? That. I think square is truck dealer, so I think. Or is it that? Okay, I'm gonna go here. Then here. And then back up to there. Actually, I'll go get gas there first, yeah. That'd be smart. light here so we should be good getting back out oh well crap I guess I can go ahead and start telling you what the project is the project is I'm going to be getting lawn mowers and push mowers and stuff like that buying them fixing them up and selling them um, currently is why I've been so busy with that is that's what changed to it I know yep hey, I didn't get a ticket part um the reason why I've been so busy is I've been searching Craigslist to let go and a couple other sites to find old mowers and crap to buy and I'm gonna make videos of fixing them and I'm also going to do custom projects on some of them so I'm going to do mine which is going to be a workhorse it's going to be a dolly mower I'll show y'all how to do dolly it's got have a lift kit on the front. I don't know how to do a rear end lift kit without making it cost a lot of money. The front end is pretty cheap to do a lift kit on. And why ain't no one going? There we go. So yeah, uh, there will be special builds like I'm doing mine, which is going to be take the longest, but it's going to be the best one of all of them because I'm going to take the most time for it. Um, I might make some race mowers just to sell because people will buy like some things that look cool. Like if it looks cool people will buy it just for the looks of it. So I'm thinking why not do that on a mower because you have people who will make cars and trucks look amazing. Why not do that with a lawn mower? So, that's what I'm going to do. Man, we'll see. I'm trying to get mowers for like $50 cheaper. And then push mowers for $20 and cheaper. And sell the riding mowers for a reasonable price at $250. The custom ones 
um, are going to be 250 plus whatever I put into them. So they're going to be more expensive, obviously. Oh, that's cool. There's a skate track here. Skate park. But they should be... I'm going to do some budget ones. Like, the ones... I'm going to do a couple with just paint jobs, so that's not going to be too expensive to do. Um, but we'll see. Another light for now, right? So yeah. So if y'all want some ideas of um, more jobs that you want me to do, either that color or that truck is disgusting. Um, if you have any ideas of mower designs to do, like mine is going to be a retro red and black. I might do a fully blacked out one. I'm definitely going to do a fully blacked out one with a light bar on it as a custom one. Um, so that's going to be a pretty cheap custom. I'm also going to do a military one, which is also going to be pretty cheap because it's pretty much just going to be a paint job. And then all the mowers I do, I am going to paint the underneath of the deck with bid liner after I clean it out to keep rust and crap out of there and then do the top of the color of the mouth if it needs it. And I'm not going to paint every mower, obviously. I'm going to try to save some money, but I will make videos on almost everything I do, and those will be put up on Moto Monday, at least for now. Uh, they might have their own separate day once I start getting really into them, but I think it's going to be like once a, twice a month. So that way, moto vlogs don't run out of that easy because I can only record them on the weekend. Alright, I got Peter Belt discovered. Don't know why I was going in there. So now I can buy Peter Belt trucks if I want to. I'm happy with my old Ken North though. So now I just need to find Volvo, which I think I'm going to do in the next year. So yeah, um, give me ideas for custom jobs. I think I'm going to do two race ones, and on one of those I might do a flame job. Now the race ones, I'm going to, they're probably not going to have a mowing deck. I just do that, yeah. Okay, heck. Oh wait, shit. Did that lower the price? Oh, they got rid of the one. Confirm. Got rid of the one on one. Okay. And then on the dolly I'm making, that's well too much, but it is going to be a beast. And the racing mowers, I think those are gonna be dollies. Um I'm gonna teach you guys how to make your own mowers fast as well. Um, and it's actually fairly simple. You just have to pulley swap them. If you don't know what a pulley swap is, it's where you take the big pulley off the axle on the back and then the small pulley off the engine and you swip them, swap them. So instead of having a like eight to one ratio, which is what they normally have from factories, they differ a little bit, but like, that would be eight spins of the small pulley equals one spin of the big pulley. It would be a one to two, which means one big rotation equals two, or something like that. Uh, which means speed. 
and also a lot more power so like if I make some other tractor builds like bullies and sell them I would do that with them but there's also just gonna be like normal mode like not all of them is gonna be custom like I said there's going to be some where it is just literally the stock mower I might repaint it with the stock paint job or it might not even need a paint job and go from there now of course this business isn't really going to kick in until summertime because you don't really need a lawn mower right now okay if y'all no no y'all going let's say if y'all ain't going i'll go And then push mowers, of course, are just going to be get repainted and stuff. I'm not doing custom paint jobs on them. That's just stupid. The push mowers, I'm going to take the least time into them. Just make sure they run. Maybe paint them if they need it. Uh, but that's about it. What is it with the pink on the trucks? the like weird bright colors I don't have that mod installed there's this mod installed where um, it's more variety in colors of AI traffic and for some reason it makes vehicles those colors which are the worst colors to have a vehicle but. so right now I'll tell you some of the things that I found of interest for this. Well, actually, once I get on a straightaway. Text and driving people don't do it. But yeah, I'm almost fully verified on let go. But I found um, this $150 parts bundle um, as go kart and dart bike. The dart bike looks fixable, the go kart only needs an engine unless someone took parts off of it. I'm also getting a set of tools, um, a bunch of sockets. They have these um, wrench socket things. They like, they're like they like wrench ends that goes on the socket. So that's kind of cool. Um, $50 black and white. Oh, I don't know. I think it, it's Craftsman. $50. Um, needs a new paint job. Might do that one as the military one because it's an older metal one. I have three push mowers here. Um, the two with the engines need work. Then two them out. They don't really look like they run, but I don't know. One of them might surprise me. And then the one's missing an engine, but I can probably find one somewhere. Uh, which I have found one. It's a Honda motor or a push mower, but they want $60 for it, and that's going over budget for a push mower. Five push mower wheels for fifteen dollars. Might invest in those if I need them. Montgomery Ward riding mower. It is a big riding mower for sixty dollars. That one I would make into a workhorse lawnmower and sell it for probably three hundred. Found a snapper riding mower. It's a small little one for twenty five dollars. Uh, that one I'd make into my own little ice mower that I would mow the grass with as well. Let's have fun with it. A red and black Troy Belt. Well, of course it's red and black. It's Troy Belt. Troy Belt on mower. It looks newer. They won $100 for it, which would be fine because I'd probably sell it for $300. It only looks like um, a wheel needs vent back into place on the mowing deck. Green and black ride on mower. I don't know the model of this but it looks like it's in pretty decent shape this thing probably just needs a little bit of work done to the engine and then sold made it in order to sell uh white and orange ride on mower they want 75 dollars for it but i'll see if i can get for cheaper obviously then we have uh two green john deers one's missing the hood but i can make that into like a race mower or sell it like that and hello traffic um, and I'm going to say $100 50 for each see if you can take that because he didn't put a price he just said negotiable 
some lawnmower blades, $20. Um, six or seven riding mowers for six twenty-five. Probably buy a couple of them by themselves. Out of that. A lawnmower lift for fifty dollars. Snowplow blade for my beast of a mower I'm making, thirty dollars. JD mower blades. There's two different sets, so for twenty-five dollars a set, so fifty dollars for both sets. A riding mower rear and assembly transaxle for twenty dollars. I would do that if need be, so that I just kind of have. And then I have a sander on my list, on Craig's list. I ain't on let go to where I can get to where I can sand the paint. It is a wood sander, but I can make it do with it. And then let's see here. Now let me pull up Craigslist, which is going to be harder because there, I don't think there's an app for it. I'll not sign in at least. For sale. No, for sale. All for sale. One posting has expired, some Craigslist and was removed from your favorites. Oh no, I don't know what it was, so. Um, let's see here. A Yamaha TTR 1.5. Of that on there. That's a dirt bike. That's not one. It's a cool dirt bike, but I'm probably not going to get that. No. A $100 lawnmower. It's one of them that looks like a... It's a mower that looks like a go-kart, pretty much. I'd make that into, like, a racing mower. Well, I might just actually get a new seat for it and then sell it for $300 because it looks like it's in good shape and I also have a 1970s Moto Bikane Mopad for parts or fix for $395 I might try to get that for $300 because I don't know how much work so that would be a cool little project on Moped uh, that's pretty much all the stuff I have for projects now I can that I have like that I found um, but yeah and then the mower that I'm getting is a old cub cadet that we are picking up today from my mom's boyfriend's mom's house it's their old mower they don't use it anymore uh, they said they'll give it to me for free the only thing it needs is a ignition coil needs the ignition coil and a battery and then it should run like new it's a 20 horsepower yeah is that a though that's not legal in west virginia so i don't see how that's legal to drive on the road here but whatever yes those aren't legal in west virginia i know it's weird yeah they should make four wheelers and dark bikes legal again to ride on the road like as long as you're driving carefully well. like driving like a normal person but if you're doing wheelies and shit then they should be able to impound it like come on that's all you have to do and then make it legal again and no one would care right because okay i can see problems with them but come on guys like, just make it to where you need to buy a speedometer for it. Because on dirt bikes, you can get a speedometer that hooks on for a bicycle and just, like, hook that up for it. It'd be fun. And it works. Or just get a phone mount and get a phone speedometer. And as long as you have that to go speed lane, you should be able to drive it. Like, is that that hard to make as a wall? Come on, car, go past. I need to turn over and you're being an asshole. I hate that. I had my turn single on and he just like kept staying there. He wouldn't slow down a little bit or wouldn't speed up to where I could go. He just stayed there to be a pain in my ass. <sighs> hate people who do that. It happens in real life too. It's a pain in my dick. 
just turn the car cover off. Good old dirty beam water to calm you down. That's good one's point five. Let me slow down. Prius. Alright, now it's story fuck. Stop hanging the time thing on me. The way this wheel is shaped, it makes me want to like grab it weirdly. I need to get a new wheel, and I want to get one with a shifter to where I can shift in this game. And that will actually teach me how to shift in real life, because you can stall up trucks in this game. I mean, it's harder too, but... So yeah, I want to get a wheel with an H shifter eventually. And then I'll still use my um, setup thing here. I have a, um, so I'll use part of the farming sim wheel still, and then just have this part that's not going to be used. This will be my backup in case the one breaks, because I've never heard of these wheels breaking. I'm using them. But it's like awkward, because it's face, it's a tractor wheel. It's made to be a tractor wheel, and it's not like comfortable to drive anything else than a tractor wheel. Why am I having an engine malfunction? There's almost nothing wrong with my truck. Let's see. How close? Okay. Once I get in town, I'll get that. I'll go fix my truck because apparently my truck's not happy. And then it'll be good. Here there's Tesla station. I'm sorry. I don't like Teslas. Gas and diesel for the winning, my dudes. Apparently, a lot of other countries make diesel cars. America only has diesel trucks, though, for the most part. I think there's a couple of diesel cars, but not all. That is weird. You would think that America, the, like, more power equals life, would have this crap. No, it doesn't. Surprisingly. Shouldn't you be shifting up right now? Because you're at that sweet spot. Giant could drive loose. Gotta love it. No, I should take a screenshot of that. Ah, sorry, dude. <sighs> yeah, I got it. So, tell me what y'all think of the new business thing I'm doing. Um, hopefully make some money off that to where I can do like project build, like good project builds, builds, and then maybe if I get enough people watching, I can do giveaways or something. So like people do a bike rebuild and a car rebuild, we do that for riding motors. I don't know. It'll be cool because you can get something to go like 40 miles an hour, 30, 40. So that'd be cool. At least in my opinion. I don't know. Um, if y'all want me to do a custom design, let me know what it is in the comments section, and I might do it. But if it's pretty pink unicorn, I'm gonna turn you down. Sorry, there ain't no pretty pink unicorns in West Virginia. Don't even think of that, Damien. I know Damien would do something like that. That looks pretty cool. I don't know, that kind of sucked. I'm trying to get a screenshot for this because I like having thumbnails of screenshots in this game. Okay, will you stop engine mount, engine mount functioning? We're almost in town. So, stop being retarded. And next episode, there will not be engine problems. I promise you, Dad. Because I will have fixed it. 80 miles an hour. Bullshit, my dude. Viva Las Vegas! Viva, viva Las Vegas! Again, 
Las Vegas. Sorry, guys. Why is Las Vegas like speed and stupidness? I'm so confused. I get it's supposed to be like the big city or whatever. Like, come on, my dudes. We don't need to go 80 in town. That's insane. You know, I'm from West Virginia and think 45 is a good speed line for in town. Don't judge me. At least 35. I hate 25 mile an hour speed lines. Especially in like my uncle's truck because it has power. It's hard to keep it at 25. The comfort a comfortable speed for his truck is 30. Yeah, plus. Wait, it doesn't want to go slower than that. At least not cruising speeds. I mean if you're like backing a trailer or something, yeah, I'll go. Oh, come on. I hate that I have to go over there and get the thing. What do you want? No. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I'm not skilled enough at driving these things to do that. Am I stuck? Are you serious? Hey, I got the thingy. Uh, what should I get? I think I'm gonna get... Fragile. Yeah, I said I'm gonna get all of them. Up to three. Alright. Um... Wait, do I still have a loan to pay off? No, nope, I paid them all. Cool. So now this money is mine that I'm making. Alright. Let me put a marker to there where I'm going now. And I will end the video there. Because I know some of you are probably tired of watching. And if you want if you don't want to watch it anymore, uh, go ahead and click off. By all means. I know y'all probably did, alright. And if you're still watching, comment down below hashtag Trucker's Life. See how many people watched it this far. Which is probably like maybe one person. But hey, we shall see. Come on. He's turning red. Wait, is this even a light? No, it's not. It's a stop sign. Why aren't you going? Go! Stupid van. Plenty of opportunity to go. There's no red light. Because of that, you pull up a little bit. For traffic. Now there's Carmen all over. Thank Jesus. I don't understand how this town works. If it's like this in real life, but if it's like this in real life, nah. I'm, I'm used to old country backwards. Don't, don't give me none of this shit. Yes, I'm go. Oh shit, I'm going to Rusting's place. 
That's why my fellow friend. Why is there four lanes in town? This makes no sense to me. I don't understand this. I was about to say, do I need to go over another one? No. No, I do not. Maybe I do. I have no idea. Las Vegas, you interesting. Interesting, interesting place. I do need to get over one more. I can do. Wait, what's the speed? 30 and people's 160. And cops don't care because Las Vegas. They probably don't give a crap. Is there cops in Las Vegas in this game? Because it don't look like it. People going 60 and 30. Come on. Yes, I'm finding a resting place. Shut up. Stupid game. Trying, but you put a red light in my way. And or land over. Please turn green, please turn green. I should turn green and then turn red again before I make it. Oh my god, I swear to god, that was that. Okay, thank god it didn't. Oh, you're an idiot and then get over. And I had to pay for that because you're retarded. And turned into me. Got it. That makes perfect sense. Oh no, you do it too. And I missed the turn. I had to turn back there. Your turn. I already caused an accident, apparently. So let's just do that as well. I need that. I got in the lane, which the guy could have easily turned in at the same time I did. Uh, but no, he had to make it difficult and then rammed into the side of me. And because AI are gods, I have to pay for it. Motherfucker. And next to green, I'm not going to be able to go on it. Nine miles. Four thousand five hundred miles on this truck. How about this truck and you? This is tracked in trailer, so that's not really too many miles. Volvo dealership. Right? Truck dealer is closed. Alright, well, tomorrow I'm gonna go see what Volvos they have. Because I didn't know they had Volvos in this game. Alright, well, thank y'all. Well, actually, no. I'm gonna keep it rolling and let y'all see what Volvos they have. So, I'm gonna just come over here, park retarded. It won't really matter. How you park. Also, don't know if you shut your truck down correctly. Nope. Go go to sleep again. There you go. Yeah, I'm using my um, keyboard and mouse to drive. After I look at these, I am... Cool. You have that little guy. That one. That one won't change that bad. That one. I'm trying to figure out... I can't even trade in on... Oh, it has to be level 11. 
Let's see what you can do to it. And of course, I won't waste anything. Okay. Alright, I got a good bit of engines for it. I'll go mess with that. No, can't change that. Ooh. Yeah. Gun mill. I like the gun mill. More sized. Can do a lot more stuff to this one. Oh hell yeah. And do come go now. Do the flag. Oh okay, that looks good. Do the side mirrors. There's plates obviously. Camel lights are crumb ship, crumb ship looks good. Can't do that. Oh, it's good. And I had to get rid of that for that, but. Ooh. This thing actually doesn't look too bad. You can do a good bit to it. Double exhaust, obviously. Cones on guards. What about these? Okay, those look cool. Alright, interior. Interior, I like it. I like the interior on this thing a lot. Is there any Volvo wheel? No, well, it's just this one, and then obviously the truck and ops. Alright, well that's cool. Thank you all for watching this video. If you liked it, hit that like button. You can see more videos on this channel. Hit subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.